You have a real courage, and you, you did it ahead of everyone. So what do you say to people now who might be struggling with any sort of identity issues? And I think a lot of people are. Yeah. They really are. It's hard, but you really just have to always... This is a tricky question because there's no simple advice. I think everyone always wants an easy answer, but you really just have to get over the hump of caring what anyone else thinks. And there's no magic potion. I wish I could like give it out. You just have to do you always. And I don't know why people are so worried what everyone else thinks, especially with cancel culture, right? No one, no one's doing shit. Yeah. Everyone's afraid to say one wrong thing. So that's why I've always just not fucking cared. You know, so you just have to let go of that and just do you and always and stick to what you want to do. I think everyone tries to be what they what something they're not, especially in this city. Right. It's all perception. So do you think social media has made it easier or or harder for mm. people to feel good about themselves, for people to feel comfortable? I think with way their... harder. Okay. Yeah. For some reason, everyone compares themselves <clears throat> to what everyone else is doing, but we all have our own journey. So we were talking about this in our last podcast. And I think I'd like to, to clarify this. I haven't quite like nailed this thesis, but mm-hmm. I think like every generation has its war, you know? Yes. And like, I think w- a war that our generation will experience is the war on overstimulation mm-hmm. and, and the actual effects of what that can do to a human brain. It can't be good. Yeah. Right. Cause you can pick up your little infinity box here, open up TikTok for a laugh or go on YouTube to be inspired. And then get a text from your uh, girlfriend that she's breaking up with you. Now you're sad, but you want to be happy, so you turn on Netflix and do this. And then you look at someone commented and said you're you're fat or some shit. Yep. And and this constant chaotic whirlwind of emotions happening in our brain instantly. That all that I just said could happen in, in a minute. Yep. 